Each included study has a risk of bias table. Each row in the table consists of a risk of bias item, for example, allocation consumment, the author's judgment for that item, and a description that supports the judgment. Creating a new review in RevMan, the risk of bias table will typically contain the following items of bias. Random sequence generation. This refers to the selection bias due to inadequate generation of a randomized sequence. Allocation consumment. This refers to selection bias due to inadequate consumement of allocations prior to assignment. Blinding. This refers to performance bias or detection bias due to knowledge of the allocated interventions after assignment. Incomplete outcome data. This refers to attrition bias due to amount, nature, or handling of incomplete outcome data. Selective reporting. This refers to reporting bias due to selective outcome reporting. Other bias. This refers to bias due to problems not covered elsewhere in the table. To see the underlying explanation, pause the cursor over the item to display a two-tip text. If this is the first time you use the RevMan, the risk of bias items may not have been activated. To activate an item, open the property for the risk of bias table by clicking on the property icon next to it. From the list given, select the items that you wish to activate and click on the Activate button. Click OK to exit.